right in front of the park, beautiful cafes. And one of them are El Portal Cafe. Beautiful pastries. Good coffee. Very nice uh, cafeteria uh, in front of the uh, park. Uh, Cafe Condesa Express also. It's, it's a nice experience just walking in this beautiful park. Uh, as you can see, everybody. Uh, well seated and uh, enjoying their day, you know. Very pleasant place to be any given time. In the evening, even in the early evening or in the early morning, uh, afternoons. Very pleasant place to be. To enjoy Antigua. Uh, yes. <laughs> so I'm actually looking at the park from uh, the northern side. Portrait of the uh, portrait of the uh, Las Posas Machiquita Machiquila Puntun Petan, and that's in the Petan, that's uh, way outside of uh, Antigua, uh, away from Antigua City. Uh, it's more like in a jungle, and you will find uh, this place, lovely place. That's where Tikal and the Mayan uh, sites are located as well. Very beautiful portrait. Here's one of uh, Guatemalan indigenous cooking her meal. This is the main square, the main park here in uh, Guatemala, Antigua de Guatemala. Semana Santa, portrait of the Semana Santa, where they have the possessions uh, right after they do this, it's actually the same night, uh, that happens around uh, April, March, April I believe, Holy Week, I'm trying to figure out what this portrait is about. It says here, Calle Baniadas de Plata, las que hacen galeadion mais nuestra parque centro américo, América. Ah, maybe this is Guatemala City. 
Beautiful um, portraits around the, uh, the park here. This actually is a, a sort of a bird's eye view from above, you know, of the, uh, the central park where I'm at at the moment. If you look over here, that's the church, the cathedral, and that's the park where I'm here standing. That's the cathedral right in front of us, right there. It's just some beautiful, wonderful um, portraits that the uh, of the volcanoes and uh, this is actually volcano de la Boca Costa. Uh, Guatemala has a whole, you know, range of uh, volcanoes, so there's so many. <laughs> uh, but this is main areas here where, you know, you'll find indigenous people uh, sitting and selling their other crafts and uh, handiwork, you know. This is a, a picture of the portrait of the lake at Utlan, where I'm heading next, actually, I believe, just by looking at it. This is a picture of, it looks like a, it's a lagoon, also a lagoon. Yes, they have an area called Laguna del Parques. These are beautiful portraits there. That's one of the cenotes. Uh, they call him here uh, Creator Azul. <laughs> it looks more like the cenotes that are in Mexico. It's all part of the Mayan culture, you know. When you look at uh, Tikal, which is the main area here, this one I'm going to show you right now. It is going to be a little dark, but uh, that's the Mayan sites. And this is the lake at Itlan, you know. Beautiful, beautiful place. I'm heading there next. That's where I'm going. Folks, bear with me. More video coming up. Guatemala and it's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Lakes, volcanoes, all the above. You're gonna miss nothing, anything. See that smile, that friendly. The people here are very, very friendly. I would say 
Don't hesitate if you get the opportunity to come here. Because I've been here many times before and I keep coming back. And there's always a reason why someone will return to a place. Not only because I adopted a little son here, but <laughs> I actually, I just love the place. You know? Especially right here in this general area. It's actually the tourist area, that's why it's a little more expensive, you know, to lodge, to stay, accommodations wise. But, uh, you know, you can split it. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go down to the lake area where it's less expensive. I'm going to spend some time there. So, between here and there, I'll sort of split my stay here in Guatemala. And they are both beautiful places to be any time of the year, believe me. And uh, you won't regret it. I haven't, and I know you won't. This place called Guatemala de Antigua is full of museums, sights to see. Uh, there are many, many restaurants, cafes. You can sample almost any type of food here. It's very good. Uh, the postrates here, like uh, <laughs> they have something called elote here, is the best I've ever eaten in, you know, in my life. Uh, tiramisu, all of the you know pastries are beautiful, wonderful, great, you know. So uh, you love it here, you know. Something, it's a place that. Uh, I've discovered many, many years ago, and uh, I keep coming back for more and more and more.